I went out into the garden, which is what people would have done. They'd have had a wee cable yard, a rather lumpy carrot. An onion. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Loads of tatties, of course. Oh, that's <coughs> a funny one. Oh. Whoa. <laughs> like <a witch's> <laughs> <laughs> oh, I've got the witch's broomstick too. And I put, picked a white turnip as well. So those are going to go into my broth. I've been frying them up, not in butter, but in goose fat, because people used any fat that was around. And then when the soup is cooked, when the broth is cooked, just about ready, I'm going to chop up some greens to go in it. And that's two different sorts of kale, and that was the most common sort of cabbage. In fact, this soup I'm cooking is very often called kale. And I speak to old ladies in the women's rural and they often call it kale. I need to peep. Just give it a minute longer. It's cooking. It's cooking. <coughs> I'm going to need more skill to turn the big one over. I should have done the little one. It's easier. <laughs> New hens. Look what colour egg they're laying. Blue. Oh, it's blue. I thought it was white. Oh, blue. It is blue. Yeah. I just thought it was a shadow when you held it up. Look, absolutely blue. Well, have they been oh, fed blue eggs? Wow. Have they been yeah. fed blue dye? No, they're a different variety, a different breed. And I've got a very old hen who's laying eggs that look all crumpled and they must hurt her, I think, when she lays them. Oh, they do. I want an ostrich egg. Pure blue ostrich egg. Gosh. Wish me luck. Good luck. Good luck. Oh, yeah. I've done it. Yeah. I, I don't think I could toss it on that. It's too heavy. You couldn't, you couldn't do that business. Yeah. Oh, yes, please, love. That would be really kind of you. That's nice. Mm. Mm.